Come on. Okay. Okay. Ready? So after five epic films, you guys have gotten to know each other pretty well. So I wanted to play a little game with you, who's more likely to? Great, we love Great. games. That Shoot them, yeah. Steal something from set. Uh, apparently Rob stole a lot of things from set. Uh, not me. Definitely not me. I, I, I've heard rumors of, uh, of uh, a certain man named Rob stealing some under underpants. From another person? <laughs> like, I've stolen, I've stolen a lot from just general crew members. Did you <laughs> from their wallet. Stealing. Mm. <laughs> How about borrowing? I didn't steal it. I mean, they knew they knew I took it. Ashley has been very open about the amount of borrowing she's done. So oh, well, really? Well, she said she got her, her from New Moon, like her sunglasses and on her scarf. This is just a gut instinct too. Don't get mad at me, Peter Facinelli. Mm -hmm. What did you take? Uh, I took my rings. I took basically the entire costume from the first one and wore it until the second one. I tried to steal Mackenzie Foy, but I wasn't allowed. Peter has my motorcycle, so he he, he likes to steal things. <laughs> I thought they would call me later and offer me something, I and they never too. did. I did too. I kept thinking I'd get, you know, my original Esme bracelet. Yeah, but we're actually still waiting. Have had to put the most money in Mackenzie's swear jar. <laughs> that would most likely be Roberto. Probably Kristen. Probably Kristen. Rob. Kristen. Kristen. Yeah. <laughs> Nikki Reed. Yeah, One probably, of the two. you know, she does swear more than Rob, I think. Yeah, I don't know about that one. You, perhaps? No, no, my mom would. Put some soap in my mouth if I did. <laughs> Hi. Me. That girl. Yeah. I've been getting a lot of that. Yeah, I know. It's awful. I don't think she put any money in there, but she should have done. Who is more likely to wish they had a scene where they got to sparkle? Sparkle. Taylor. Does Kristen sparkle in the last one? Taylor. Yeah, she does. Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, too. So I, I would probably say me, actually. Everyone's saying that. <laughs> uh, well, that must be true, right? Because I, I never had that opportunity. I'm a little jealous. Ashley. No, Kellen. I would reckon Kellen. Everyone's saying you. Yeah? I don't know why Kellen didn't do any sparkling. Hold Peter. on. <laughs> yes! <laughs> don't you think? Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I even said myself. Everybody, everybody knows me, I guess. Keep their awesome vampire posture all the time. Most likely to? Mm -hmm. Me. Mmm. I would go with Ashley, maybe. Yeah, she Elizabeth. Too. Elizabeth too. Yeah, very yeah. much so. Definitely a girl. I don't know. We just all talk about it a lot. I think you know, Rob. I think lives like this. He'd be. I feel like he'd be a foot taller if he stood up straight. Kellen. I think Kellen always keeps the vampire posture and be like. Be in a movie musical. Um, me. Nicole. I mean, <laughs> she's a singer. Peter Facinelli. <sighs> A cool, cool musical. That would be me. Definitely Taylor, actually. Jackson. Taylor's really into musicals. Rock, <laughs> rock star band one. That'd be sweet. Or Nikki. They both love music so much. So I, one of those two. I'm not sure about that. I would <laughs> love it if we could do some kind of duet musical I action. I could be in like a dance me and movie Liz or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah totally. I could be your backup dancer. I'm Welsh. I have a beautiful singing voice. So that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> okay. In spandex. We've actually thought of it already. Yes. <laughs> Play a superhero or heroine in a film. Say Kristen. Taylor. Hey, this guy. I've heard Ashley saying that she would like to be not only in a Bond film, but that she'd like to play Bond herself. Kellen or Peter? The, the superhero one, not that. Hey, I wouldn't mind playing heroin either. <laughs> <laughs> Wonder Woman? How? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. If I close my eyes. To get the loudest screams during the credits. I'm gonna go with Taylor. Well, if Taylor's topless, probably him. Kristen Stewart. Liz Reza, because I know that she wouldn't want that at all. <laughs> Billy Burke has a sexy mustache. That mustache has its own six pack. It's an eight pack. Have a lingering resentment towards the contact lens technician. Uh, again, I'm gonna go with Rob. Me. Rob. Yeah, if yeah. I see those lenses, I will go crazy. Send Christmas cards to everyone in the cast for the rest of their lives. Elizabeth, because she's just lovely. Yeah, maybe Peter. Nikki. Mackenzie. She's like the sweetest girl I've ever met in my life. Do the best arrow impression. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna go with Mackenzie. Is there like a technique for doing that voice? Is like how? Well, it was Stephanie wrote in the in the in the first book that Arrow's in that he had a voice like feathers. So you just have to imagine feathers, and then you just let the voice come out. Eat the most pie at Thanksgiving dinner. Once again, I'm gonna go with Kellen. That would be me. I do like me some pie, to be honest, which is why obviously I've got. Fat vampire, Michael Sheen. 
Wow. Who, had, who had all the pies? Arrow. Be a big Honey Boo Boo fan. Who's Honey Boo Boo? You don't want to know. Okay. I'm going to guess that Dakota would have been the big fan of Honey Boo Boo. I'm just going to torture Taylor. I think, I think him. Probably be me. <laughs> okay. <Nick> Listen. <laughs> Are we going to be honest right now? Okay. <laughs> Um, but... How do you define fan, though? Yeah, it has crossed my obsessed? television screen. <laughs> Rob. Yep, I think he's a secret closet Honey Boo Boo fan. I actually really like Honey Boo Boo. Win an arm wrestling challenge. I have to go to Kellen, probably. He's all roided up. Kellen. Well, I guess Kellen. Kellen. I think this guy. This guy. Yeah, but if we can, can we just take him out of the equation at some yeah, point? Yeah, if like, we take him out, I, I would have to say Nikki. <laughs> he thinks. Me. Kristen is very toned. What? You don't believe me? Stuart can throw down? Come on. Okay. Okay. All right. We don't have a table or anything. We can do it like this. Okay. Okay. All right. Ready? Oh my god. <laughs> I had you for one second. God, that was actually pretty, all right? Pretty impressive. I'm like, so I'm like. I mean, I'm a pretty small girl. I feel emasculated right now. <laughs> oh my god. That's awesome. You could take him. <laughs> yeah, you know. I don't know. You could take him. I mean, I'd, I'd have to make him very, very emotional first. So beautiful. In the same temperature now. Where you guys really look great together. Every obstacle you faced, I think you couldn't overcome it. And you just did. Don't look away. I've never thanked you for this extraordinary life. Nobody's ever loved anybody as much as I love you. Breaking Dawn Part 2, rated PG-13, November 16th. <laughs> These shoes suck. I have no shoes. I ran out of socks. Hey, Andrew. Hey, Andrew. Thought we were going to do that together, so I did it in a... Okay. Anyway, you didn't one, two, three. Oh, you're supposed to one, two, three? I'm slow, remember? I'm so game. Reed can throw down. I do try. Yeah. I try to get, I and try she's to. she's passionate. It's part of it is just, you know, the will. We had many a day where we would complain about our contact lenses. When English people swear, it doesn't <laughs> sound like swearing. Proper swearing. <laughs> just uh, a lot of chafing. She actually has a bodyguard standing outside the door that says no one's allowed to bring a lens in. <laughs> you can't even wear a lens yeah, in Yeah, you can't even. <laughs> Sparkle. We're actually still waiting, wait, 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 so you can, you're welcome to air this and maybe Summit will send us our wigs or something for fun. Thank you. Can we just do interviews Thank like you. this?